Come on, give me something cool. I can see people's locations. Well, that's a bit boring, isn't it? Hey, Mom. So, what did you get, sweetie? I can see people's locations. Can you check where your brother is for me? Sure. Where is my brother? It says he's at Jackson's house. At Jackson's house? He's supposed to be at school. Gotta go, Mom. Hey, Giselle, can you see people's locations? Yeah, I can. Can you please look to see where my boyfriend is? Of course. Where's Isabel's boyfriend? It says he's at Olivia's house. Olivia's house? I knew he was cheating on me. Mom, I'm home. Honey, please check to see where your dad is. Yeah. Where's my dad? It says he's getting sushi. Hey, guys, I'm home. Dad, you're supposed to be getting sushi. What do you mean? No, I'm not. Mom, I'm home. Honey, please check to see where your dad is. Yeah. Where is my dad? It says he's getting sushi. Hey, guys, I'm home. Dad? You're supposed to be getting sushi. What do you mean? No, I'm not. Hey, Mom, can I talk to you alone for a second? Sure, honey. What did you want to talk about, sweetie? Are you sure that's really Dad? Of course it is. What do you mean? His location says he's still getting sushi. It's probably just a glitch. I can't deal with this right now. I have to go finish dinner. Now he's on his way home. You know what? Maybe the thing was glitching. Where is my dad? In trouble? Dad? Giselle, get your mom and get out of the house. You two are in trouble. The man there is not me. You know what? Maybe the thing was glitching. Where is my dad? He's in trouble? Dad? Giselle, get your mom and get out of the house now. You two are in trouble. The man there is not me. What do you mean it's not... Mom? Sweetie, you're just in time for dinner. Actually, can I talk to you first? Can it wait till after we've eaten? No, it can't. This is important. Fine, but make it quick. So, what's this about? Mom, we have to get out of here now. What do you mean? Why? The man in the kitchen is not Dad. Giselle, you're being ridiculous. Of course it's Dad. No, it's not, because Dad just called me and told me we need to leave. Is this another one of your silly jokes? I don't have time for this. No, Mom, I'm not. Look, where is Dad? Hey, what's going on in here? I'm starving. So, what's this about? Mom, we have to get out of here now. What do you mean? Why? The man in the kitchen is not Dad. You're being ridiculous. Of course it's Dad. No, it's not, because Dad just called me and told me we need to leave. Giselle, is this another one of your silly jokes? I don't have time for this. No, Mom, I'm not. Look. Where is Dad? What are you two doing? I'm starving. Me and Giselle are just about done here. Let's go sit the table. Mmm, honey, the food was so good. Giselle, aren't you going to thank your mom for the food? Yeah. Thanks, Mom. Giselle, can I talk to you? Alone? What did you want to talk about? I know you know I'm not your dad, and I want to know how you found out. You better not say another word to your mom. You're not going to hurt us, are you? I won't hurt you if you cooperate with me. The outcome depends on you. Do you understand? Understood. Only say words that start with D. Dude! Sissy, I got a D on my test. What's mom going to say? Disgraceful. She's going to say I'm a disgrace? Giselle, how does my outfit look? I want to impress Jake. Disgusting. What do you think he's going to do when he sees me? Dip. Ugh, you're such a bad friend. Dramatic. Do you think the new guy is cute? Duh. I'm going to call him over. Don't. Hey, Liam, Giselle wants to ask you something. Hey, Giselle, uh, what did you want to ask me? Date. A date? Should I pick you up at 7? Definitely. I think you're a sweet girl. Dream. Wow, you think I'm a dream? Donkey. You're saying I'm a donkey? Dog. Dang it. You can only say words that start with S. Stupid. 
Sweetie, does this outfit look okay for my job interview? Mm -mm. Scary. You think it looks scary? I worked so hard on it. Sorry. How do you think I should dress for my date? Simple. Hmm, something simple like this? Slay. Class, today you're going to tell each other what you want to be when you grow up. Giselle, you can go first. Shooter. Excuse me? Slut. And that's a detention. Shit. So you're the girl with the questionable career choices. Shut. You're kind of cute. Space. Give me a kiss. <laughs> Smelly. Stop. Can only speak in TikTok? BFFR. Hi, honey. How was dinner yesterday? It was bussin' bussin'. Bussin' bussin'? Yeah, no cap. Thank you, I guess. Giselle, does my outfit look okay? Slay. Wait, really? Girl, you ate that. Scrum to be yum yum, my burr burr. Wow, thank you. Look at the new kid. Isn't he cute? Mid. I heard he's got something going on with his stepsister. Sweet home Alabama. My boyfriend keeps hiding his phone from me. That's sus. I think he's cheating on me. It's not giving. Giselle, will you go on a date with me? Are you simping? Yeah, so will you? No, thank you. I'm in my independent queen era. Put your hands up. Only in Ohio. Can only speak in TikTok again? L. Giselle, look at the girl your ex-boyfriend is talking to. A whoop jump scare. That's the girl he cheated on you with. I might kill my ex. I heard they're officially dating. His new girlfriend's next. Mr. Fitz is so cute. I wish he would notice me. Side eye. What? Side eye. Do you think I should take my boyfriend on a picnic? That's so cringe. How about a movie? Yeah, W Riz. Cute necklace. Is it from Shein? It's the knockoff Chanel bag for me. Ah, oh, how dare you! She really thought she ate. I got an A on my math test. Period. Period? Do you need a pad? How was dinner, honey? Ate and left no crumbs. You're adopted. This is my 13th reason. Get adopted by a race car driver or a billionaire? I'd be kind of scared something would happen to the race car driver, so I'm gonna go with billionaire. Who'd you pick to get adopted by? Oh, I chose a billionaire. You got that as an option? My choices were a garbage man or a teacher. That is so not fair. Whoever it is is gonna think she's weird anyways. She'll be brought back. This is the man who's gonna adopt you. Hi. Hi, nice to meet you. First things first, you're gonna need some of these. What are these for? A lot of paparazzi follow Mr. Knight. I'm his assistant. Hi, I suggest you put those on now. Mr. Knight, is this your new daughter? This way, darling. Your house is really nice, sir. Aw, oh, thank you. What's that? This is a list of things that I wanted to do with my new parents. Are you married? Actually, sorry, kid. No, I'm not married. That's okay. I'll just adjust some things. I don't know about this. People are loving that you adopted her, and as soon as they write enough good articles, we'll bring her back to the adoption center. Good morning. You look sad. Well, it's just that I can't find any of the clothes that I brought with me. Oh, darling, that's because I threw them away. What? Why would you? They were hideous. We can't have you wearing orphan clothes. But- Hush, follow me. Oh, this is much better. But the dress is a little bit short. You're 16, not six. Now hand that thing over. No. What's going on in here? Mr. Knight, your assistant. She's trying to take away my plush. Susan? She needs to act her age. Please don't let her, Mr. Knight. This is really special to me. She's too old for it. It has to go. <gasps> no. Don't be so dramatic, dear. You'll be fine. Smile, Madeline. We're going to do a photo shoot. Smile bigger. Stop the cameras. That's enough pictures. Here, Madeline. Look what I found. How about we do something on your list today? I saw you wrote down Disneyland. Want to do that? Okay. It's beautiful, isn't it? Psst, kid, here. Thank you. Madeline, we need to talk.
Mr. Knight doesn't have time to be taking you places. He said that he had fun spending time with me, and that I can keep this. Oh, is that so? Don't make me send you back to that- Susan, I need your help. Coming, sir. What's next on the list today, kid? Are you sure you have time? Yeah, I need a little break from work anyways. Well, I always wanted to go to a science museum. All right, science museum it is. Susan, prepare a driver for us, please. Of course. Have a good time? Yes, it was so much fun. <laughs> it really was. I'm... What is more useful when it is broken? It's an egg. It has to be an egg. No way. It's a glow stick. Say glow stick. So which is it? An egg. A glow stick. If I don't get this right, I'm going to die. The final decision is yours to make. An egg. Correct answer. An egg. Mom, I'm home. No, I got a riddle. You need to read it out loud. What is always in front of you but can't be seen? Right in front of you, but you can't see it. Air! It has to be air. It's always right in front of you, but nobody can see it. The answer, air. Incorrect. Correct answer, the future. Mommy's gone. I, I really thought I was right. <laughs> I got a riddle again. What can fly but has no wings? I, I don't know. I don't want to be wrong again. Please help. I can only live if there's light, but I die if a light shines on me. A shadow! A shadow! Correct answer, a shadow. Bye, Mom. I'm off to school. Sissy, I got a riddle. Hurry, read it to me. What can run but can't walk? A turkey? No, don't say turkey. Final answer. It's a river. It's a river. Are you sure? I think so. A river. Correct answer, a river. Oh, no. I just got a riddle. Hurry, read it out loud. We can all help you. What has 21 eyes but can't see? 21 eyes but can't see. Come on, give him suggestions. I don't know. I know the answer. It's 10 and a half blind people. Incorrect. Correct answer, a dice. Oh no, I got another riddle. What can fly but has no wings? I don't know. I don't want to be wrong again. Please help. Final answer. A ghost. Say ghost. Okay. No. Go it's time. Are you sure? Yes. The answer is time. Correct answer. Time. I hate this game. I don't want to play. Sissy, you need to be strong, okay? Quitting isn't an option. I just got a riddle. What is always spelt wrong? That's an easy one. The answer is wrong. Wrong is always spelt wrong. Wrong? No, it can't be that simple. But what if it is? The answer is wrong. Correct answer, wrong. I just got a riddle. Hurry, Grandma, read it. What can clap with no hands? 
clap with no hands. You're behind. No. I can only live if there's light, but I die if a light shines on me. A shadow, a shadow. Correct answer, a shadow. Bye, Mom, I'm off to school. Sissy, I got a riddle. Hurry, read it to me. What can run but can't walk? A turkey? No, don't say turkey. Final answer. It's a river, it's a river. Are you sure? I think so. A river. Correct answer, a river. Oh no, I just got a riddle. Hurry, read it out loud, we can all help you. What has 21 eyes but can't see? 21 eyes but can't see. Come on, give him suggestions. I don't know. I know the answer, it's 10 and a half blind people. Incorrect. Correct answer, a dice. Oh no, I got another riddle. I'm gummy, gummy, gummy. Stop playing. Gummy. Playing is against the law. You're lucky no one saw you, or else you would have been killed. Catch! Let's play. We're not allowed. We'll get killed. That's only if they see us. No one's around. Okay. Catch! Catch! <laughs> Catch! Catch! Were you girls playing? No, I wasn't. It was just her throwing the ball. I wasn't playing. No, she was playing too. No, I wasn't. No, Poppy, you're not allowed to play. No play. Why do you have a ball? No, Poppy, you're not allowed to play. No playing. Why do you have a ball? Were you playing? I wasn't playing. I was just teaching the puppy not to play. Good work, kid. I'll kill the dog. No! Brianna, we're all going to hang out after school. Are you coming? A hangout? Are you crazy? Relax. We're all just going to talk and study. There's going to be no games or playing. Okay. Hey, we should all play spin the bottle. No! I thought we were just going to study. We're not allowed to play. What, are you scared? Are you a chicken? No, I just don't want to die. All right, I'll go first. I can't believe you're actually doing this. Look at that. The bottle landed on you. That is not happening. Were you playing a game? No, I wasn't. It was Brianna's idea. Speech? What's this? It's a new thing started by the government. You're given a certain amount of words a day, and you must use all of them, or else. Well, I only have 18 words today. That shouldn't be hard to use. Brianna, how many words do you need to use today? 18. Wow, you're so lucky. I got 5,000 words I have to use today, so I have to talk super fast, and I have to use lots and lots of words. Talk, 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 talk. I can't stop talking, can't stop talking. The day is almost done. Did you use all your words? Yes. These are my last words, too. Oh, no, 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 I got 100,000 words to use today. How can I use all those words? You'll have to try your best. I don't understand. I only have 55 words, now I have so many. What's wrong with your voice? I lost my voice talking so much yesterday. I won't be able to use all my words. No, no, you can do it. You can. I can hardly talk. I want to switch my words back. Hello? The government? Are you there? God? Let's see. <laughs> see how much mommy and daddy love me? Or see how much are in their bank account? I already know mommy and daddy love me, so let's see how much money they have. Wow, they have a billion dollars. I must be getting a lot of Christmas presents this year. Merry, Merry Christmas. Christmas. Thank you. What else did you get me? That's it, Pumpkin. We didn't get you anything else. Mommy and Daddy are very poor. But I see that you have a lot of money. Uh, there must have been a mistake. Don't sound spoiled. Be grateful. So, guys, any chance I'm going to get a phone for my birthday? Oh, poor thing. No, you're too young. Yeah, I figured you were going to say that. But when do you think I will be old enough to have a phone? You'll get next one next year. Next year, you literally say that every year. No, we don't. 
In other news, today marks 16 years since billionaires Mr. and Mrs. Connors' baby daughter went missing. Wait, that baby kind of looks like me. In other news, today marks 16 years since billionaires Mr. and Mrs. Connors' baby daughter went missing. Wait, that baby kind of looks like me. If you have any information, we urge you to call this number. That can't be me. I'm just being delusional. We should give her back now. The reward is $1 million. But how do we get the reward money for her without them knowing we took her in the first place? Shh, let's talk about it over here. The number on the TV, they said to call it if... If you have any information, we urge you to call this number. I need a phone. I'll have to take mom and dad's. No, I just gotta call this number. No, I just gotta call this number. Oh, what the hell was that? <gasps> you want to tell us why you were in our room? And why my phone is cracked? I, um, I didn't think you guys saw me. I was just, um... What is this? <sighs> she knows we're not her parents. She was trying to call the number on the news, huh? Well, you know what? It's about time she found out. Surprised it took her this long. I mean, how could she never question how we all have different hair and eyes and why we never let her on social media? I mean, come on. You two are sick and I'm leaving. No, you're not. Now turn. We gotta make you look pretty for your billionaire mommy and daddy. They'll be so happy. And the final touch, a little bow. Aw, oh, babe, isn't she so cute? Your birth parents are offering a big reward for you, so you better not mess this up. Now, get into that box, and no talking. Now, get into that box, and no talking. Richard, what in heavens did you order? This box is not from... me. What is going on? Read the note. It'll explain everything. Your prayers have been answered. Here is your biological daughter. We have to send the one million dollar reward to this number or you die? Yes, so please just wire it to them right now and I'm so sorry about all of this. Darling, this doesn't sound right. I think we ought to just call the police. Yes, darling, I agree. No, please, no, police. I, I can prove to you that I'm your real daughter. I know how much is in your bank accounts. It's two billion exactly. How do you know that? Because I picked to see how much money were in my parents' bank account. It says if we don't send it, she will die. What if she is our daughter? Can you please just send them the money? No, I have to call the police. I'm not sending anyone money. I have to call the police. Wait! No! We have to get her to a hospital. Doctor, is she going to be okay? Ma'am, we can't have you in here. Mr. and Mrs. Connors, we have some good news. She's going to be okay, and we did the blood test as you requested, and it does look like she is your biological daughter. Richard, did you hear that? I can't believe it. Hi, darling. Don't worry. Everything is all right. Those horrible people have been put in prison. What's going to happen to me now? We're going to take care of you, love. You are? Yes, we, um, we found out you're actually our daughter. I knew it. We never stopped looking for you. Your father and I missed you so much. We love you. Hey, what's the matter? No one's ever told me that before. Well, we'll be telling you that every day, love. Now you get some rest. And we'll be here when you wake up. Happy birthday! Wow! A gummy bear! Thank you! There's one more gift for you. Who's it from? There was no name. It's blank. Happy birthday! Thank you! Now there's one more gift. Another card. Does it say who it's from? It doesn't say anything. It's another blank card. Happy Sweet Sixteen! Thank you. Let me guess. Another blank card? Yes, it's the same one as always. Who would do that? Every single year. Happy birthday! Oh, you got a card? Who's it from? I don't know. Every year on my birthday since I was 10, I've received a blank card in the mail. That's kind of creepy. Wait a minute. White ink. There's something written in this card. White ink. These cards aren't blank. There's something written in them. My papa reads encrypted messages for a living. We can take the cards to him and find out what they say. What do you have for me? This is the first card I received when I was 10. Ah, uh, yes. Find me where the flowers grow. I'm in the garden down below. That doesn't make sense. What is it, some kind of riddle? Maybe we'll understand if we read all the cards. This is the second card. X, Y, Z, X, B. That is the key to set me free. Do you have a pencil? Here. What are you doing? 
I'm writing it down. It must be some kind of code. This is the third card. The place I am you have in your memory. We used to play there before you were stolen from me. Wait a minute. I know the place. Bye, Mom. I'm off to school. Aren't you going to school? I'm trying. What in the world? Hmm. Play. Here's the exam. It should take you about three hours to complete it. No, if only I could fast forward it. Oh, wait. Is that my exam? That's impossible. That only took you 1.2 seconds. Yeah, I'm just super smart. Hmm, let's try the up button. Oh, oh, oh. I can fly. Wow, that is so crazy. There's just one more I haven't tried. Pop. Pop. You seem fine. You're still talking. Yeah, but my body can't move. Whoa, why did controls just appear above your head? Oh, you can see them? Okay, press play for me. And why should I? Please? I don't know if a please is good enough. Pretty please? All right, play. Brianna, hurry, you're going to miss the bus. Oh, don't worry, I'll just run home. Run home? Your house is a two-hour walk from here. It's okay, I'll just fast forward myself. Hi, Mom. I'm home. That was quick. School just ended. I know. I ran really fast. Good morning, Mom. I'm off to school. What the? Time to see how much money my boyfriend has in his bank account. Not that that's important. I knew he had money, but not that much money. I'm going to pay him a little visit. Hey. Hey, handsome. I shouldn't tell him I know what's in his bank account. So, baby, what do you want for Christmas? Well, there is this Gucci bag that I really like, but you know what? What am I saying? You don't have to get me anything. Come on. Of course I'm getting you something. In fact, you might get that Gucci bag as long as you're not too naughty. I'll try. Right now, why don't you go out and buy yourself whatever you need? Okay. Bad news. What? Fluffy's sick. The vet says she needs surgery. Mm. Well, how much is it? It's about $2,000. We can't afford it. You know what? I think I got it covered. You sure? Yeah, I'm sure. Oh, good. Babe, I'm... Whoa. Back. Listen, it's not what it looks like. We can't break up. I need his money. I can't break up with him. I need his money. Uh, her and I are just friends. Yeah, I'm gonna go now. Bye. Babe, I made a mistake. I'm sorry. It's okay. We all make mistakes. And it was my bad, really. I should have knocked before coming in. Thanks for understanding. She kind of made a mess. Do you think you can clean up? I gotta go to work. Of course, honey. All clean, and you just go make the money. Thanks, babe. Love you. Bye. He is so dead. I'm so happy Fluffy's okay, but how did you get the money to pay for her surgery? Mom, about that. There's something that I need to tell you. I can't believe he cheated on you. I know, but now that Fluffy's okay, I think I'm gonna go break up with him. What? Looks like he just got another paycheck. And you still have his credit card. Don't break up just yet. I have a plan for how you can get revenge. Hey, sweetie. Merry Christmas. <laughs> Who is she? You know, I was about to ask you the same thing, but you look really familiar. Are you a model or something? Uh, actually, yes. Figures. I'm sorry, babe, but this girl was just leaving. But you said, no, stay. I think you're going to want to see this. I actually got him a little something. Here you go, sweetheart. Thanks. Oh, wait, but first, before you open that, I believe this is mine, right? Uh-huh. That's your Gucci bag. That's the one you wanted, right? Yes, it is. Thank you. Okay, go ahead and open yours. All right. What's this? Receipts of things that I bought this week. Baby, 10 k worth of stuff? Oh, baby, you and I both know that you can afford it. Oh, and there's a card in there, too. Go ahead and read that. Roses are red, violets are blue, you're a dirty, rotten cheater, I'm breaking up with you? Merry Christmas. <laughs> Girl, let's get out of here. I'm right behind you. Wait. Ladies, I'll buy you anything. No amount of money is worth being with him. Goodbye. Please help me. Oh, uh, did you need my help finding something in the store, or...? Hey, can we hurry up the line? I'm on my lunch break. I don't got all day. Do you need medical attention? No. Hey, it's okay. Can you wait over there for me, hun, and I'll get someone to help you? You're allowed to use three words maximum when you go out. 
Don't be playing games with me this time. I'll be checking your words when you get back. I'm so sorry. The line is really busy right now, but my manager will be over here to help you soon. There you are. You took forever. Did you return the shirt? Good. Let's get out of here. Damn, why do I feel like I'm forgetting to do something? Wait a minute. You were supposed to make dinner tonight. Go on. What? Is dinner ready? Hey, 8,996? You used an extra word, and you're gonna tell me why. You used an extra word, and you're gonna tell me why. Go on, talk. Explain yourself. It was an accident. I was just telling the cashier thanks. Uh-huh. You sure about that? Yes, I swear. You should really have your dinner. It's getting cold. That's enough talking out of you. Go to sleep. Bed, now. How did you make that chicken? Why? Because, after I ate it, my head is filling. <sighs> my phone is dead, and his is locked away. I have to get the charger. Please hurry up. <gasps> yes. 911, what's your emergency? I need help. Thank you for the information, ma'am. Officers will arrive shortly. You. You thought you could get away with putting something in my food? Your words. Why did you use up so many? Actually, don't speak. I'll mm. find out. You can't outsmart me. <sighs> so step away from the girl. Let's see your hands. Looks like I just did. No. Babe, I thought... Don't you dare use any more of those words. Understand? Five million words? That's ridiculous. You won't be using any of those. I'm... What did I tell you about talking? I'm breaking up with you. Oh, really? Where are you gonna go? You don't have any money. Nine million words this year, huh? No one needs that many. Hey, I need you to go to the store for me. I don't like that pink shirt you bought yesterday. I want you to return it. You're allowed to use three words maximum when you go out. Don't be playing games with me this time. I'll be checking your words when you get back. Hi, what would you like to return? Just that? Okay, hold on one second. That'll be $6.99 back on the card. Please help me. Why you lie about the guy? Is it true you lied? She should have died? I didn't lie about the guy. She's not thinking clearly. Dissy, rhyme it. They time it. She's out of her mind. Seriously. Okay, I'll believe you. But I got my eye on you like glue. I can't believe my best friend's gone. Bring him back. Come on. They timed it and he couldn't rhyme it. It's the world we live in. He never win. I don't want to be here anymore. Please. Rhyme it. They time it. You have so much to live for. I don't want to see you on the floor. Anymore. Anymore. I don't know. You look down. What's with the frown? I just saw someone get killed. Your head is a mess, but you can't stress. They time it. You need to rhyme it. I just saw someone get killed. Your head is a mess, but you can't stress. They time it. You need to rhyme it. I just saw someone get killed. I wasn't very thrilled. Please, keep your mind at ease. What'd you get on the exam? Exam. Exam. Rhyme it, they time it. Hurry, you need to worry. Stop yelling at me. I can't think of what rhymes with exam. Good morning, honey. Today's nice and sunny. You're not speaking? What are you seeking? Are you scared? Your rhyming is impaired? You must speak. No one is allowed to sneak. You rhyme it, I'll time it. Why are you doing this to me? Tick tock, the time is on the clock. Why are you doing this to me? You rhyme it, I'll time it. Tick tock, the time is on the clock. Why are you doing this to me? Just let me be. You're safe. You're lucky. Lucky. It's your time to rhyme. You're safe. You're lucky. Come on, Brad, you wouldn't shoot me. We're partners. I'm sorry, Bob. I'm just doing my job. How are you feeling? Um. Rhyme it, they time it. Feeling? You rhyme better than anyone I know. Just go with the flow. I'm scared. You're out of time. You couldn't rhyme. What's going on? My partner's gone. 
Now it's your best friend's time to rhyme. Five rhymes in the given times. Five rhymes in the given times. You need to rhyme in time. You can't rhyme the same thing twice. It isn't nice. Five to stay alive. I, I don't know anymore. You don't know? It's time to go. No, my best friend, you put her to an end. You're a monster. Rhyme it. They time it. You're a monster. Tick tock. The time is on the clock. Hey, you can't steal my gun. You're done. Happy birthday, daughter of mine. I bought you a gift that is so divine. Why am I six? You need to rhyme it. Be careful because they time it. Why am I six? This needs a fix. You get older every year. That's how it is, dear. I'm actually 17. Happy birthday, daughter of mine. I bought you a gift that is so divine. Thank you. You need to rhyme it. Be careful because they time it. Thank you for this gift. It was really on my list. Yo, bro, can I have a bite of that orange? Orange. You need to rhyme it. Be careful because they time it. Uh, I don't know what rhymes with orange. What rhymes with orange? Come on, you need to rhyme it. They time it. Nothing rhymes with orange. Sissy, you're home. Come play with me. I was all alone. Of course I'll play. How could I stay away? Perfect. You be the stepmother and I'll be the princess. Um, princess. Sissy, they time it. Rhyme it. You be the stepmother, I be the princess. Hurry up. They time it. Rhyme it. You be the stepmother, I be the princess. Um, princess. Sissy, they time it. Rhyme it. You'll be the stepmother, I be the princess. Hurry up, sissy. They time it. Rhyme it. You'll be the stepmother, I be the princess. We play just like recess. I do shoot. I want to dispute. We time it and she didn't rhyme it. She's so breezy. She might not be leaving. Please let me try to save my sister. I miss her. Go, but tell anyone about this and I'll know. She's going to be okay. You can visit her where she stay. I miss you, little Missy. One of our partners nearly killed your sister. Tell us what happened with the mister. He timed it and she rhymed it. He shot her by mistake. His mind must have been on break. Why you lie about the guy? I'm a gummy, gummy, gummy. Stop playing. Gummy. Playing is against the law. You're lucky no one saw you or else you would have been killed. Catch. Let's play. We're not allowed. We'll get killed. That's only if they see us. No one's around. Okay. Catch. Catch. <laughs> Catch. Catch. Were you girls playing? No, I wasn't. It was just her throwing the ball. I wasn't playing. No, she was playing too. No, I wasn't. No, Poppy, you're not allowed to play. No playing. Why do you have a ball? No, Poppy, you're not allowed to play. No playing. Why do you have a ball? Were you playing? I wasn't playing. I was just teaching the puppy not to play. Good work, kid. I'll kill the dog. No! Brianna, we're all going to hang out after school. Are you coming? A hangout? Are you crazy? Relax. We're all just going to talk and study. There's going to be no games or playing. Okay. Hey, we should all play spin the bottle. No. I thought we were just going to study. We're not allowed to play. What are you, scared? Are you a chicken? No, I just don't want to die. All right, I'll go first. I can't believe you're actually doing this. Look at that. The bottle landed on you. That is not happening. Were you playing a game? No, I wasn't. It was Brianna's idea. Beach, what's this? It's a new thing started by the government. You're given a certain amount of words a day, and you must use all of them, or else. Well, I only have 18 words today. That shouldn't be hard to use. Brianna, how many words do you need to use today? 18. Wow, you're so lucky. I got 5,000 words I have to use today, so I have to talk super fast, and I have to use lots and lots of words. Talk, 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 talk. I can't stop talking, can't stop talking. The day is almost done. Did you use all your words? 
Yes. These are my last words, too. Oh, no, 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 no. Honey, what's wrong? I wrote 100,000 words to use today. How can I use all those words? You'll have to try your best. Hey, Tom, you're Understand? I only had 55 words. Now I have so many. What's wrong with your voice? I lost my voice talking so much yesterday. I won't be able to use all my words. No, no, no. you can do it. You can. I can hardly talk. I want to switch my words back. Hello, the government. Are you there? God? Let's see. Keep on trying to talk. The day is not over yet. I, I can't. Bestie, I'm so sorry. I love. It's okay. It's not your fault. I heard from your best friend's mom she passed away. She couldn't use all her words. Are you okay? Yeah. I'll be okay. Grandma, what is that above my head? Those are all your childhood memories, dear. And it looks like you've already made quite a lot of them. Well, that's good. Because I want to remember all the fun things I did with you. Oh, Annalise, you are so sweet. <laughs> There is a fire in the castle. We need to get you both out now. Grandma, I'm scared. I don't want to lose you like I lost my parents. Don't worry, dear. We'll be alright. My queen, watch out! The ceiling is collapsing. No! You left your clothes on the floor. Sorry, I just... They pay me to foster you, not to be your maid. Didn't anyone ever teach you to clean up after yourself? Well, you know, even if someone did, I really wouldn't have remembered because I lost all my childhood memories. Yeah, yeah, enough with your sob story. Just clean up. Excuse me, sir. Do you know why there's a bunch of flowers everywhere? Oh, yeah. Those are for the princess. Everyone leaves those for her. Today marks the fifth year of her passing. It's awful what happened to her. Hey, are you okay? I think I just had a memory of me being a princess. Sorry, I know that sounds crazy. A princess? Wait, did something happen to your memories? Yeah, actually, when I was younger, some sort of accident happened to me. I don't remember what, but the doctor told me that I have amnesia. Some people still think the princess is still alive. They do? Yeah, and actually, I'm one of those people. You know, I could take you to the queen if you really think you're the princess. No, that's okay. Uh, I really should be going. <laughs> At least take my number. If any more of your memories come back, call me. I can't believe that guy thought that I was a princess. My queen, watch out! The ceiling is collapsed! No! no, no. Grandma? She left me. Uh, my head. Hey, I got your voicemail. You got another memory? I think that I am the princess, and I need your help to take me back to the queen. I think that I am the princess, and I need your help to take me back to the queen. The thing is, they won't just let anyone into the castle. We have to convince them that you're royalty. But how would I do that? I have an idea. Come on, we're going shopping. Are you sure this outfit isn't too much? No, I think it's perfect. It shows the queen that you know how to dress like a princess. If you say so. Wait here. The queen will see you in just a moment. Hey, it's gonna be alright. She'll remember you. Grandma, I thought I'd never- See me again. I've heard it all before. Tell me something that only my Annalise would know. Well, I can't exactly do that because a lot of my memories got lost, but I remember you. Stop. My heart can't take this anymore. She's just another girl pretending to be my granddaughter. Take her away. No, please. I came all this way to see you. I'm sure I can remember something. Let's go. A carousel music box. It was blue. You gave it to me. Wait. A carousel music box. It was blue. You gave it to me. Wait. Let her go. I need to get- Hey, how many years did I get? You- you got infinity. Gay me! No, honey, that's not good. You're going to live long after everyone you know and love is gone. Hey, Brianna, something came in the mail for you. What's the letter for? Anything interesting? It's a invitation to another funeral. Oh, I'm so sorry. It's okay. I'm used to it by now. Now what is a lovely lady like you doing sitting here all by herself? I'm just waiting for the bus. How about I take you out on a date? What do you think? I don't date. I don't get attached to anyone nowadays, actually. All right, suit yourself. 
Have a lovely day. Wait. That mark on your neck. It's the same as mine. That mark on your neck. It's the same as mine. So now you're interested in a date. I finally have someone to keep me company for all eternity. You'll never have to be lonely again. <laughs> Who's that? Oh no, that's the local years thief. She steals people's years. She can do that? She can. She's a witch. Run! I think we lost her. We should be safe here. <laughs> no! How could you? He's all I had. <laughs> Wait, don't go. Take my years. I don't want to live anymore. Mom, what's on my face? Oh no, you got an X. You need to cover it and put a check mark right away or else they're going to get you. Who? Oh, thank goodness you're safe. You got a check mark. I've located an X. Please don't do this. <coughs> Everyone report immediately for your symbol check. So, what happens if you have an X? Those with Xs are eliminated to stop overpopulation. You're only safe if you have a check mark. Next, please. I'm next. Don't worry. You have a check mark. You'll be fine. You're good. Next. I said next. Are you crazy? What are you doing here? Why would you go online knowing you have an X? I thought maybe I wouldn't get caught. Of course you would get caught. Who are you? Do you have an X too? So, where are you taking me? This is the X's hiding spot. I made it my personal duty to protect all X's. Wow, you're pretty heroic. Excuse me, miss. May I sit here? Yes, of course you can. Why would she have an X? She's just a baby. The X's were given at random. No reason and no sympathy. Oh no, they found us. We have to leave immediately. Hey, ugly. Excuse me? Why would you say that? I'm sorry. It was for a task. I'm in the 90s now. I thought so. Good luck. I hear the last 10 tasks are impossible. Hey, girl. Hey. Ah! Did you hear what Tom did? What? No. His 95th task was to stab someone, and they ended up in the hospital severely injured. The whole school's in the 90s now. It's about to get very dangerous here. It's really dangerous here. Let's go somewhere private and talk. Yeah, sure. No one's around. I think we'll be safe here. Yeah. So, what did you need to talk about? I'm so sorry I have to do this. What are you doing? I have to do this. I have to kill you. I only have two tasks left. That money is mine. No! I'm so sorry. I'll call you an ambulance. I'm not going anywhere until I finish my task. Well, I've made it this far. I might as well be the one to finish all these tasks. Get adopted by a race car driver or a billionaire? I'd be kind of scared something would happen to the race car driver, so I'm gonna go with billionaire. Who'd you pick to get adopted by? Oh, I chose a billionaire. You got that as an option? My choices were a garbage man or a teacher. That is so not fair. Whoever it is is gonna think she's weird anyways. She'll be brought back. This is the man who's gonna adopt you. Hi. Hi, nice to meet you. First things first, you're gonna need some of these. What are these for? A lot of paparazzi follow Mr. Knight. I'm his assistant. Hi, I suggest you put those on now. Mr. Knight, is this your new daughter? This way, darling. Your house is really nice, sir. Oh, thank you. What's that? This is a list of things that I wanted to do with my new parents. Are you married? Actually, sorry, kid. No, I'm not married. That's okay. I'll just adjust some things. I don't know about this. People are loving that you adopted her, and as soon as they write enough good articles, we'll bring her back to the adoption center. Good morning. You look sad. Well, it's just that I can't find any of the clothes that I brought with me. Oh, darling, that's because I threw them away. What? Why would you- They were hideous. We can't have you wearing orphan clothes. But- Hush, follow me. Oh, this is much better. But the dress is a little bit short. You're 16, not 6. Now hand that thing over. No. What's going on in here? Mr. Knight, your assistant. She's trying to take away my plush. Susan? She needs to act her age. Please don't let her, Mr. Knight. This is really special to me. She's too old for it. It has to go. <gasps> no. 
Don't be so dramatic, dear. You'll be fine. Smile, Madeline. We're going to do a photo shoot. Smile bigger. Stop the cameras. That's enough pictures. Here, Madeline, look what I found. How about we do something on your list today? I saw you wrote down Disneyland. Want to do that? Okay. It's beautiful, isn't it? Here, here. Thank you. Madeline, we need to talk. Mr. Knight doesn't have time to be taking you places. He said that he had fun spending time with me and that I can keep this. Oh, is that so? Don't make me send you back to that- Susan, I need your help. Coming, sir. What's next on the list today, kid? Are you sure you have time? Yeah, I need a little break from work anyways. Well, I always wanted to go to a science museum. All right, science museum it is. Susan, prepare a driver for us, please. Of course. Have a good time? Yes, it was so much fun. <laughs> it really was. I'm sorry if I'm too much of a distraction for you. Kid, you're not a distraction. In fact, I think you're exactly what I needed in my life. Okay, you rest now and I'll see you in the morning. Good night. Sir, the paparazzi got you at the science museum today. And so many articles have been written. I don't care about the articles anymore. What? Shh, I'm not gonna use a kid to get me more publicity. The plan's off. But sir, guess I'll just have to get rid of you myself. And I know just what to do. I found someone from your real family. You did? Yes, dear, your Uncle Nick. I don't remember an Uncle Nick. He'll explain everything, darling. He's here. So you're her mom's brother? Yeah. How did you find me? You're all over the news. I know you probably don't recognize me. Your mom didn't really talk about me much, but I'd like to adopt you. I'm happy here with Mr. Knight. Madeline, don't be rude. At least give him a chance. I don't want to push anything, so how about you live with me for a week, and if you don't like it, I'll bring you right back here. Uh, okay. Yeah, that sounds good to me. Oh, perfect. You call me on this phone if you need anything, okay? I will. Thank you. Of course. Come here, kid. I bought you some candy. Susan tells me it's your favorite. Thanks. We'll be at my place soon. Is it good? Why do you have that stuffed animal? Oh, uh, one of my best friends from foster care gave it to me. You don't look so good. Are you feeling okay? No, not really. Hey, it's me. The candy worked. She's half out of it now. Excellent. All right, time to come inside. Come on. Finally, I can take this from her. So what do we do with her now? Well, she's already got Mr. Knight all the publicity he needs, so she's no longer of use to me. Susan, what's going on? Oh, Madeline, isn't it obvious? I'm getting you away from Mr. Knight. He's mine. Mr. Knight is gonna find me. He's not gonna look for you, because Susan's been telling him that you're fine. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, darling, but I need to be the focus of... What do you think you're doing? Everything's fine, sir. I want to talk to her. Ah, uh, sorry, she just fell asleep. Thanks to this brat, Mr. Knight is getting suspicious. You're not going to get away with this. Mr. Knight is going to find me. <gasps> it's him. Stay calm. I will handle it. Mm, so I can assure you, everything is fine. Help! Wait, don't open that... Madeline? I'm sorry, sir, but you're supposed to be in love with me, not her. You're my assistant. But I wanted to be more than that. You're insane. Both of you, get back. Susan and your fake uncle have both been arrested. I thought I'd never see you again. I am so sorry this happened, Madeline. But I promise, as your father, I'll protect you from now on. Father? So you still want to adopt me? Aw, oh, kid, of course. I mean, after all, we've got that list to finish, right? And look what I found. I love you. Dad. Madeline, I... I love you too. Aw, you're so silly putting stickers on your face. <laughs> no! You killed your big sister! You can't ever laugh. It kills people. Look what you've done! <laughs> Here, before coming into the classroom, you must put this tape over your mouth. Why? It's a precaution issued by the school board, as kids are the highest risk for laughter. I don't want to wear the tape anymore. You must wear it. <laughs> We're just kids. He didn't do it on purpose. Listen, kid. I saved your life. You could have died. You should be thanking me. Mommy, you forgot to pick me up from school. Good evening. Please? 
police officer. There was an incident of laughing at your mother's work. She didn't make it. Stop laughing. <laughs> Stop laughing. What's going on here? You killed Officer Brad. Uh oh. We're gonna need backup. <laughs> Did you hear? She killed three police officers when she was seven. You know I can hear you, right? I was just a kid. I was traumatized from my mom just passing away. I couldn't control it. You're a murderer. A psycho. I can't listen to this any longer. Hey, are you okay? I can't believe what they're saying about you. I'm used to it. Want to hang out after school? There's somewhere I want to show you. We're almost there. Where are you taking me? We're here. In the middle of nowhere? You know those three police officers you killed? One of them was my dad. <laughs> Sissy! Oh no. Ellie? Sissy! Ellie! Did they lock you in the cabinet? Hurry, I'm losing oxygen! No, this better be the one. Ellie! I'm so glad you found me. It was so scary. They took me and hid me in the cabinet. This game is sick. Brianna, why do you look so down today? My little sister was chosen to be hidden this morning. I almost didn't find her in time. How about we make a pact? Pinky promised that if either of us gets hidden, we'll find each other. Pinky promised. It's your turn to be hidden. It's your turn to hide. Get in there. Where did they lock me? Help! Help! I was chosen to play hide and seek! Please, someone find me! Help! I don't have much time left! Help! Jake! Did you call my name? Jake, you found me. Of course I did. I promise you. I can't believe they locked you in a locker. It was awful. Well, it's a good thing I found you in time. You're the best, Jake. Girl, there you are. I was wondering what happened to you. You weren't in class. I got chosen to play hide and seek. Luckily, Jake was there to save me. Hey, it was nothing. I'll catch you later. Catch you later, Jake. Wait, you dropped this. I got a nose bleed. Why is it blue? Oh no, you're one of them. Leave immediately. But why? Leave. But mom, it's spreading. Emily, I'm so scared my blood is blue and it's spreading and I don't know what to do. You're one of them. Stay away from me. I'm so scared. Does anyone know what's happening to me? Teacher, teacher, her blood is blue. She's transforming. Stay right there. I'm calling the police. <laughs> no, no, I'm leaving. I'm leaving. They won't stop spreading. There she is. We found her. Get her. No. What is happening to me? Hello, dear. <laughs> don't be alarmed. I'm one of you. What's happening to me? Why am I turning blue? You're transforming, so don't be afraid. We are able to cover it up and live as normal functioning members of society. There, it's covered up. But may I ask what exactly I'm transforming into? You are one of the few chosen to transform in a rare breed of superhuman. Superhuman? But I don't understand. Why are people afraid of us? <laughs> Where did she go? I haven't seen you before. Are you new? Yeah, I just transferred here. You should totally come have lunch with us. Yeah, I'd love to. Mm, it's so good. I love chocolate. You have something above your lip. Oh, let me get that. Your skin. It's blue. Do you know what time it is? You're an hour late for school. Look, I know. It's just... What's this? It's okay, honey. Just take your time and go to school now, okay? Uh, okay. I can't be let have a test. Hey, watch it. I'm so sorry. You are a pathetic excuse for a human being. Actually, you know what? It's kind of my fault. You were in a rush and I was in your way. I'm so sorry about that. This is so weird. Look, I'm so sorry I'm late. I... Due to your lateness, you will not be permitted to write the test. You know what? I don't usually do this, but I'll let you write the test. Yes. Whatever this thing is, I'm loving it. Hey, Jake. How was the test? Eh, not good. I probably failed. Really? Yeah. You look very beautiful today. I... I do? You do. Anyways, I'll see you around. Wait! What did you need to tell me? One moment. I just need to call my girlfriend real quick. It's really important. Yeah, of course! Go ahead!
I can't believe he broke up with me. He did? I mean, he did? Yeah, he did. But he's a jerk. I should just move on. Yeah, good idea. Hey, I heard about your breakup. I'm so sorry. That's okay. We needed to finally end it. Why would it say that? Say what? Hey, did you by chance want to go on a date with me later tonight? Yeah, of course. This restaurant is amazing. I know, it's the best in town. Why is that an option again? Do you think I could maybe give you a kiss? Yeah, sure. <laughs> Our date last night was amazing. <laughs> yeah, it was... I have to go. What? Why? I'm sorry. Hey, are you okay? You left in such a hurry. Yeah, I'm sorry about that. Again? There's no other options? What are you talking about? Just stay away from me. Why are you avoiding me? I want to break up. We're breaking up, so just leave me alone, okay? Wait, are you okay? You seem really nervous today. Hey. Look, I'm sorry about what happened with you and Jake, okay? It's my fault you broke up. What? I have this thing where I can decide actions people make, and I, I chose for you guys to break up, and now it's it's giving me the worst options ever. I'm so sorry. I think you should go home and rest. 